Th so thank you for talking with me. Why don't we start with, tell me a little about your district, where you're located, how many students, how many schools? All right, so we are, it's Painesville City Local Schools. We're about 20 miles east of Cleveland, Ohio. So we're a suburb, but we are the, the center of the county, of Lake County in Ohio. We are a smaller district. There's only about 3,100 kids. There is five schools. There's the one high school, one middle school, then three elementary schools. And so at our high school, we have a, right about 850 students. We're at the biggest we've been in years. So we've had a bit of a boom. So that's good. We wow. have three school counselors here. We got, we split the responsibilities alphabetically. So, you know, we have a certain amount of students that we follow all four years as they go through. So. And tell me about yourself, your name, your title, and what you do at Painesville. I, my name is Sharon Fitzgerald. I am one of three counselors at the high school. We don't really have a responsibility where somebody's a head counselor or anything. We kind of, we split the duties pretty evenly, but we do kind of split up the responsibilities where certain people are in charge of, say, College Credit Plus or scholarships or like the national testing. And I happen to be the representative who's in charge of school links and being the main contact for the school and the district, actually. Well, thank you for being that person. I really yeah, appreciate sure. that. What made you want to look for a new college readiness platform? What made you want to bring on school links? To be honest, we weren't even looking for a new one. We just knew we were frustrated with the current, the one we used to have. We did not like, it was not very user-friendly. We, the students did not get engaged with it and were not excited to use it, even though they had been using it since the middle school all the way up. And actually I started as a middle school counselor. So I was using that other platform all the way. And I was never exactly happy with it or excited about it. I was at a conference last year where a district in Columbus was presenting with the representative from School Links, where they were so excited about the program and how they were moving along with the new graduation requirements and making accommodations for the new graduation requirements in Ohio, which deal with a lot of tracking of different information and how School Links is basically building its program around it. And because of that, I mean, I think every counselor in the room got very excited about it. So I came home and we set up a meeting. I talked to our director of programming in our district and I said, you know, this sounds almost too good to be true, this program with everything that they are offering. And we set up a meeting right away and everybody got on board when they realized how user-friendly and everything School Links was gonna be and how much it was gonna help us with our tracking and everything that we're gonna have to do with all of our new graduation requirements. So we weren't even looking and we found you. <laughs> I love that. Very excited. Yeah. So the biggest driver was clearly the reporting functionality, right? Was what you would say? That and how user friendly it is. Not only from the students' point of view, where I love how they're able to use it as an app on their phone, as well as on their, it's very helpful with the Chromebook. And then also on our end, it seemed because they were even using example, the person who was presenting was showing the different, um, functionalities and things we could do from our end as counselors. And it was, it, it was a seller, like just, it was modern. You could see that it was taken into consideration the work that the counselors have to do and made it much easier, so much easier. So what was that, that role over that implementation process, like going from the old system to schoolings? Was it long, short? It was. It was a lot of work in the beginning, which is expected, but it was everything that once it gets set up, it is done and it's set up for the rest of like forever now, I guess you could say, like just linking everything. And the process was very, very easy. We were given a link, a to-do list, and within that to-do list, there is a link that it gives you a video of explaining how to do this. It's I am not an IT person. I am not good with the acronyms or like anything to do with a computer, but you made it dummy proof basically where all you had to do was watch a video and I had two screens open. I was watching the video, pausing it and then going right along with it. And it was very, very easy. It was a lot of, it was a lot of man hours at the beginning, just having to learn to link everything. But now that I know how to do it, it's, I'm so glad I chose 
to be in charge of this because it makes it look like I'm doing so much work when it only actually takes a couple minutes to do some of the programs. So just, just a few clicks and things get set that's, up. That's exactly it. I'm like, oh God, I got to upload the transcripts again. Then I'm like, I'll do it. And it's like two seconds later, but I can close my door for five minutes, you know, 20 minutes and they don't know it only took me two minutes. <laughs> so how long have you guys had schoolings now? This is actually just our first year. We okay. started it. We most of the stuff we did, like the implementing, everything started this summer in the fall that we it started with the students and the students were very excited from the very beginning, like just doing the onboarding where it came up right away, where they, you know, it tells the personality type and you could see the engagement right away. At first, they're like, oh, we got to answer these questions again. But then when it matched them with celebrities and people that they knew and it was real time we even like joked with them we're like if you match with a kardashian you have to redo it you know like just make but they were really engaged with it and even doing the different things where entering the college information they loved being able to research the colleges they loved being able to they're creating resumes that they didn't even realize they had enough information to create a resume and they are they're like oh i didn't know i could put that in there we have a lot of bilingual students and they were very excited that it's they're able to switch it to the lang their language. Most of them are Spanish and they're able to switch it to Spanish so that they are able to do the programs and all the different assessments very easily as well. They loved picking colleges and being able to watch the videos from the different colleges. The students are really engaged and they really love it, which is we've never had that with our previous platform. So it's kind of nice. And from our end, we have... Um, we have representatives coming from colleges and I'm able to click every kid that was in, interested in the Ohio State University and sent them an email right away saying, hey, we have a representative coming. Make sure you sign up and they were able to sign up for the event. So they love logging their community service hours in there. In Ohio, we have something called the student engagement seal and we've set up schooling. So they record that and everything is just so, so much less paperwork. They that they're able to email the people through the, I, I can't even, I should be your salesperson. I'm telling you, I asked, I'm waiting for the ball to drop with school links because everything has just been so easy and the students love it. We love it. It's been great. That's fantastic. Although that being said, we are going to try doing the course scheduling in January. So I don't know how that's going to happen. That might be where the ball drops. Hopefully not, but we are a little worried about it. I, <laughs> More from our end, because it's a change. I was going to say, I, I'm not worried about it from the software side. As you said, you know, we, we've, we've invested a lot in the um, onboarding implementation for everything, including course planner and scheduling. So it's more, I, my recommendation would be just make sure you meet with CS, you know, beforehand and get that ball rolling. Cause once yeah. it's set up, it's good. Yeah. yeah. It's more, you have to understand this is my 30th year in education. So I'm like change always kind of freaks me out. And so we knew that there was going to be a little bit of a change at the beginning with school links and that has gone seamlessly, but the course scheduling, I don't know why this is the one thing that's causing me anxiety, but I'm hoping it goes as smooth as everything else, but it's more like first year jitter. So. Yeah. When I'm going to, I'm going to schedule time. We're going to do the same conversation again in October. Okay. We're going to start with how did course scheduling go? All right. We could do that. Sure. Okay. Sure. Um, so you mentioned, you know, that the, the the changeover process seemed to have gone pretty well, especially for the students. Same mm -hmm. with staff. Yes. The staff, it's again, it, within the state of Ohio, we have students have to earn graduation seals. And a lot of that, there are, I won't go over all the seals, but the two of them that we use for documentation in um, school links is our community service and our student engagement. Also, with the college application process, the college application manager where they teachers have to upload the recommendations and everything. They, it's amazing. The teachers are loving it. They, they get an email from school links that says, for example, for the community service, you know, John Smith says he performed two hours of community service with you doing this. Is that true? And the teachers have a simple link. It takes them less time to click the link and confirm it than it would be to sign a piece of paper. And the same, their, the college application, they love how they just have to fill out something once, go in and they could say that it could be used for all the other colleges applications. 
they're the teachers are coming back to me. They're like, I think I did it, but it seemed almost too easy. Is it done? And I'm like, it sure is. It it honestly is that easy. And so they they're loving it. And I also love how it communicates with people outside of the system, especially in the cases of our um, community service. It you can send the email. It used to be a pain trying to get people from outside to sign papers or to confirm that it's really them. And it the students forget to send, bring the paper in. It was always a hassle. And now they fill it out and they can send an email to people even outside of our school who can confirm it and bring it back. So we're saving trees and it is so much easier. My normal last question is, is there anything else anyone should know when bringing out schoolings? But you named almost everything. Oh, <laughs> yeah, no, I, it, it's been... It has been such, it's been a wonderful experience. We're actually talking in our area. We have a, a counselor group that ha- represents three different counties in the area. And they're, I, they've even started, like, has anyone started schooling? And of course, I'm saying how much, how well we have done with the transition. And we're actually looking into having you guys come and speak at the next one, because I think that you're going to end up getting a lot more customers up in our area because it just seems it's, it's amazing. Now I can't talk to the middle school, the middle school, I, they were starting it a little bit later than we were. So hopefully their transition goes as smoothly, but I could tell you at the high school level, we've absolutely loved it. The staff, the counselors, the everyone. So we actually are using it in a classroom. We developed a new class, a college and career readiness for as, so it's going to be, it's sophomore focused and they're working on a lot of the activities and the lessons. And as a teacher, he's, really enjoying it that it is so engaging with the students that he's able to pull it right up to see what students have completed what tasks you know how far they've gotten he's able to schedule speakers coming in based on different assessments of what students are interested in and so it has really been a blessing that's great i'm so excited to hear what you're you're doing with school links and that we're able to support your district and I, and i wasn't kidding i'm really going to follow up with you in in around October and we'll see how much more you're using it. I will. And I can to also say like the customer service has been ridiculous good from where I have a simple question and I, the little chat box comes up and I'm like, are we able to do this? And they're like, I don't know. We, like, I don't, I mean, it, the feed, it happens so quickly and Carly is our contact person and she I, I, I feel bad. Sometimes I feel like I was stalking her at the beginning, asking her so many questions, but she was so patient answering every single one of them. And if there's a feature that I wasn't sure about, it was as simple as um, we had large classroom level meetings. And I'm like, is there a way to like log all the students who are at the meeting is for having contact time since we have to do that? They're like, that's a feature. Not now, but now that we know you need it, we'll work on it. So, I mean, be, I don't know if it's just because you guys are a new system or what, but you're listening to the feedback of the counselors and you are, it seems like everybody's honestly trying to improve the system as you go along and to add features as needed by the your customer. So that's pretty cool. Well, thank you so much for, Absolutely. Time, for sharing your story with us and I hope to hear more from you. All right, no problem. Thank you very much. I Keep going. You guys are doing a great job.